Welcome to Why Not Mail. This video is for new users to quickly get up to speed with using Why Not Mail. This is a basic overview, and there are more videos with more detailed information about specific areas online as well. The first thing you need to do is upload your contact list. You do this from the contact list area on the left hand tab. Click on contact lists, and then select create a contact list. Name the list and fill in the first few fields. In the custom field section, the only item you most likely need is the name. These items should match what data your email list has. At the bottom, fill out the company name and click on save. Now we need to upload the contact list itself. Click on contacts and select import contacts from a file. Select the name of the list you want to upload to and click on Next. Contacts need to be marked as confirmed or not confirmed, HTML or text, and then select if you want to overwrite existing contact details and add contacts to autoresponders. If you are unsure of any of these details, leave them set to the defaults. Then we have file details. Your email list should be in a CSV or plain text format and if it has headers such as a title, you should mark the file headers box. Your email list has emails that are separated by a value and then also a field enclosure. If you put a cursor over the question mark, it gives you more information. And if you aren't sure, leave this section as is. Choose the file button to locate your file and then click on next to upload it. The system will ask you to link up how your list maps to. You do this using the drop down box. Then click on next. Then import the file. The next step is setting up an email campaign. Click on email campaigns and then select create a new campaign. Name the campaign. Select the format, HTML or both, and then pick a template. Then click on next. On this page, you fill in the email subject and then use the WYSIWYG box to edit the template as needed. Down below you can enter in text for the email. Down at the bottom of the page there are a few fields for email validation, miscellaneous options, and a way to preview your email. When you are finished click on save and exit. When you are ready to send your email, click on email campaigns and then view campaigns. Locate the email you want to send out, click on send under the action column, select a few options, and the contact list you want to send to. Then click on next. You select a handful of options, review the information, and then click on schedule my email campaign. Your email is now ready to go out. Anytime you want, you can check the status of your email by clicking on email campaigns and then view campaigns. Under activity status, it might say scheduled, sending, or complete. To check the stats from your email campaign, click on statistics and then email campaign statistics. Here you have a list of all emails you've sent out and by clicking on view you can see the stats.